So to cycle through the, what everything is reading currently, right? Yes. It would have to be in the view menu, right? Which okay. it is now. So it's, okay. it starts in the view. Okay. Hit, hitting the item button will go through the, you know, the visible sensors and everything like that. So if you hit item once, it's gonna show how much the boiler will wanna run, right? Based uh -huh. on what the temperatures are set on, right? Uh -huh. So right now the boiler is only looking to run 41%. Uh -huh. uh, hit item again. So far the boiler hasn't run, so that's why it's showing zero hours, right? Okay. Item again, outdoor sensors reading 45 degrees outside. Uh -huh. Item again, condensate sensor. That's, I'll show you where that is. All that's right. reading 135 right now. Okay. Okay. Uh, again, so that was it for the, for the view menu. To switch the menu to the adjust menu where you can actually program the settings, you would hit the menu button, okay? okay. Now you're in the adjust menu up here. Uh -huh. 70 degrees is the default setting that you're looking for kind of in a room. Okay. This control, you can add indoor sensors to ever, if you ever want to in the future. Why it, would we? Uh, just, it gives more accuracy, right? Yeah. So if you put, it can hold up to two indoor sensors. Maybe if you put one on the lower floor, one on the higher floor. How it much? can read the average. How much? Uh, what? How Cost. much? Oh, I, that, that I'm not sure. Right. Yeah. Like a quick, uh, a quick to do, a quick, a quick. Uh, no, it would take wiring to come down here, so oh, it's really? not. You know, that could be a recommended little, or pretty much. Okay. It, it's not really uh, necessary okay. so much, right? Okay. Okay. So back to the settings. Uh, hit item again to keep cycling through the adjust menu. Outdoor design that's set for 10 degrees. The outdoor design basically is what we're telling the control is the coldest day of the year, right? Okay. So that's the default setting that can be changed, right? Mm -hmm. Sounds uh, like a not a big deal though. You don't really mess with. I mean, why yeah, you, you right. You don't really have to because that's pretty much. I'm not really sure why it even has that, but. Well, uh, we'll get to that. Uh -huh. um, so boiler design, 100. percent So that's telling on the coldest day of the year for the outdoor design, uh -huh. you want the boiler to run 100. percent Right. All right. Okay. Uh, indoor design again, 70 degrees. That's just basically kind of giving it a Got parameter it. to work with, right? Uh, 60 minute cycle. So you can change the cycle length. 60 minute is the default. Basically it has 50% on time, 50% off time. Within so, that 60 minutes? Right, yes. Mm -hmm. And you can change that to 30 minutes and have it be on 15 minutes or 15 minutes. On 15 minutes or 15 minutes, right? And it would still respond to all the boiler controls, right? So if it reaches pressure, the boiler will still shut. It's not just gonna continuously run. Mm -hmm. Uh, item again, 160 degrees is for the steam established. So I'll show you where the sensor is. Yeah. Steam obviously is over 212 degrees, right? Yeah. So mm -hmm. this is kind of low. Normally we keep it, the default is 180. So I lowered it to 160. So when that sensor reads 160 degrees, it's going to begin the cycle, right? Okay. Item again, tw uh, lockout differential, 25 degrees. So that means that it hits 160, it sees that. Uh, it starts the cycle. If any time within that cycle, that steam sensor drops 25 degrees, yeah. so 135, it would turn the boiler back on again. Mm -hmm. uh, warm weather shutdown. This is just telling the control, the outdoor sensor is gonna read the temperature. Under that temperature, the boiler will have a demand for heat. So 55 degrees is what you know New York City is wants, right? Yeah. Uh, so, I mean, that, that, that's really it. Now, all these things are changeable, right? And we can, you can change them if you deem necessary based on what the building needs, right? Looks pretty complicated, but also you get it. Eventually I'll get it. Yeah, 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 it, it's, 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 not, it's nothing crazy really. So right. now, um, let's go back to just the view menu and we'll see. So that, that condensate sensor, <clears throat> which is reading, right now it's establishing steam, right? Because we want it to come up to the 160. Yeah. Right now it's reading 131. Uh -huh. And that'll continue to go up. I'll show you where that sensor is right now. Do, 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 do. So this is the new sensor. It's on the steam line, right? Let's see, where is it? I don't see that thing. Where yeah. is it? That little thing I have zip tied there, that little brass. That little thing? Yep. Wow. Okay. So when this pipe hits 160 degrees, it's going to begin the cycle. Okay. <laughs> And then the boiler will run for 30 minutes what, after the cycle begins, right? Yeah. And then off for 30 minutes, as long as that temperature doesn't drop to 25. If it drops 25, we can bring that down lower. Uh, and if the, if the, <clears throat> it, all right, so it runs and then it 
doesn't run and then it does that all day like that or yes yeah yeah based on as long as the temperature is under 55 degrees outside okay, right okay okay if it went over 55 the blow would not come on at all all right so you think this will save us money that's the idea yes yeah more than the heat timer one yes now i can't tell you based on my settings right now right. that that will have to see what the building actually needs right, right. and that'll be based on people so, complaining and whatever yeah oh, yes if you felt if if it seems like it's being overheated, then we just lower it. That, that, that's it. I, you guys come back and do it? Or you tell no, us I can tell phone? you right over the phone. Oh, yeah, right, I okay. mean, we could come back and do it, but... All right, very cool. very cool. I know the control well enough I can tell you right over the phone with okay. the lower. All right. So, I mean, that's, that's really... That's the whole thing, huh? Yeah? That, that's really the whole thing. All right.